This is a blessing for uh, the Church of Washington. We've been wounded in very significant ways, and he is a healer, he's a leader, and uh, Pope Francis has sent us an uh, archbishop that we need. It was a turning point in my life. Uh, I think it's great news. Uh, everything I read about him is uh, just terrific. Uh, he's a wonderful pastor and uh, full of integrity, and he's had a lot of experience with uh, uh, the American hierarchy. He's been president of the hierarchy, and uh, at a critical time, and, and did some uh, really very tough things. So I think we'll we'll have a, a terrific chef, shepherd here in Washington. The sex abuse crisis was hurting the church in so many ways in the early 2000s. Uh, he was president of the conference and he stepped up. And he is the one who pushed through zero tolerance, uh, lay review boards. He understands the hurt and the pain and the loss that comes with sex abuse. And so to have him here in a diocese, which in some ways is ground zero in the sexual abuse crisis, is uh, an important sign of hope. Throughout our entire Catholic Church, certainly, but no. Uh, he'll be the first African American Archbishop of Washington, and to have him here in the nation's capital at a time of racial injustice and tensions, uh, to have it happen on the anniversary of Dr. King's death, is an important statement, and I hope uh, he can make a contribution to a country that is more just. And I admire him, uh, I'm praying for him, and I'm just so grateful that he's here.